This memoir takes place between February 26, 2011 and is still ongoing and was recorded on May 16, 2011 at 9.33 a.m. I want to thank you. <laughs> no, no, seriously. I, I really, really want to thank you. I don't regret anything that happened. I'm glad it happened. All of it. The suffocating myself for two months, putting up with you, lying to myself, you calling me a selfish and decent human being. I'm glad the way everything played out. You know, what you said really made me look at myself differently. I had to reevaluate. Honestly, I really went back to square one. I, um, I did play a, play a, play a role, you know, put on this act, this front of some troubled, hopeless, brooding romantic. I acted like my life was some sort of soap opera. I wanted that, that lifestyle. And, um, he put me in my place, so to speak. You know, I stopped, uh, blaming the world for my problems. Stopped blaming everyone else for my problems. You know, I've, uh, learned to Well, still learning to not take hardship so personal. Bad things happen. That's just life. Move on. Oh, and uh, I communicate to my friends better. I don't, you know, neglect them and um so self absorbed about myself and push them away. Huh. You know, I still saved the text messages you sent me saying those mean things. Sort of a uh, reminder to me to um, keep moving forward, you know? It's weird to say, you know, such mean things will keep you moving forward, but it's... um kind of reminds me of the person that I was and who I don't, who I don't want to be anymore and who I strive to move away from. So I'm not going to lie. I'm not, I'm not out of the clear yet. You know, there's a lot of things I have to work on in myself. But because of you, I'm beginning to work on them. So like I said, I'm glad the way everything happened the way it did. If you ever listen to this, 
Well, don't get mad. But, above all, thank you. Thank you.